Uh, my name is Emily Weigel. I am a current third year PhD student in the Departments of Zoology and Ecology, Evolutionary Biology, and Theater at Michigan State University. So the decision for graduate school was a little bit difficult for me, as it is for most people, because you have a lot of different choices to choose from. And when I came here, I heard about this program and that was really great, and it was being supplemented by something called Beacon. And Beacon is the National Center for the study of evolution and action, and it's really awesome, and that pretty much sold me on MSU. I do research in a subfield of zoology called sexual selection. It's a part of evolution trying to understand why females choose the mates that they do, so what makes a male sexy, and what factors go into female choice. So I took a course on behavior when I was studying abroad as an undergrad, and I really, really loved behavior, and it was right after I took a course in evolution that I realized I could pair evolution and behavior together and study evolutionary behavior in college. So once I figured that out, it was pretty much history from there. So sexual selection is a pretty big field, and um, I'm hoping that my research on investment, so how males and females invest in either signaling or perceiving those signals and making choices based on that, will then uh, somehow give us more information on how the process of sexual selection operates in general. So uh, the name of the fellowship that I have is the Future Academic Scholars in Teaching. And what this is, is a fellowship that's given to Michigan State students. And um, basically, the goal of it is, is to understand teaching and learning in the same way that you understand your own research. So applying scientific processes to teaching and learning. So my particular project is on understanding how students apply concepts in genetics to how they understand things in evolution. So these overarching topics in evolution have a lot to do with how one understands genetics in the first place. And if students can apply concepts that they've learned in genetics within an evolutionary framework, they have a better understanding in general of biology. So the FAST program is a really interesting one because it brings a lot of different graduates from different programs together and we get to actually discuss teaching pedagogy together. And it's really hard when you're in uh, a scientific discipline to get the training you need for teaching, and the FAST program provides that. And it doesn't just do that by giving you books or by doing special seminars, but it's dedicated time every single week that you spend to think about how am I teaching, how are my students learning things, how have I set up the lessons so that my students are getting out of it what I intend to, do my objectives match the assessment, and in the end, are the students getting out of the course what they need in life. 